Good afternoon and good evening to everyone across the pond. I have some updates for you guys regarding the transfer of Kefren Taram to Liverpool Football Club. Those following know this has been a link, a solid link, for about two weeks now with Liverpool dragging their feet a little bit, suggesting that they may wait until after the U21 Euros. However, news breaking today that we'll get into here in just a second suggests that Liverpool are doing just fine in their pursuit of Kefren Taram. Before we begin, don't forget, if you want to stay up to date on all the latest Liverpool news, transfers, or otherwise, please subscribe to the channel. Make sure you like the video as well. If you're enjoying it, that tells YouTube to push it out to more Liverpool fans. Now, let's look at the latest news regarding Kefren Taram. So earlier today, Mark O'Connell on David O'Connell's website uh, came out with an article stating that Liverpool are now talking with League One side OGC Nice and that these talks are progressing well. Liverpool looking to secure Kefren Taram for a round 40 million euros. Moving forward to the article itself, uh, it states Liverpool are currently engaged in negotiations with Nice over the potential signing of Kefren Taram. These talks between the two clubs are progressing well, according to Rudy Galetti. Now, Taram has been Liverpool's priority target since they secured their first signing, Alexis McAllister. The only thing remaining is the fee that these two clubs need to agree on. And according to Rudy Galetti, this fee is going to fall somewhere in the sweet spot for Liverpool Football Club transfers range of 40 to 45 million euros. And he also reports a big thing here that there are no issues on personal terms between Kefren Taram and Liverpool Football Club. 22 years old and for me it is just a matter of time until this deal is official and done. I think the links are extremely solid and I think it's not a matter of if, it's a matter of when for Kefren Taram. I like to think that Alexis McAllister in addition to Kefren Taram and also some other signings would be huge for Liverpool, but one thing that I did see earlier this week that actually caught my attention was that Liverpool only have two spots open that aren't homegrown spots, right? So really they'd have to let somebody go if we wanted to get any more than two other non-homegrown players. So that's something to think about, considering that we have been hearing reports Liverpool are in for a defender as well. We already got McAllister. We're sending out some people on loan, but you never know. Maybe they'll sneak in one of those unexpected signings a low cost signing, right? Just kind of under our nose, one of those 8 million, 10 million, 12 million signings just to, to fill that void. Hope you guys enjoyed this update. Make sure you subscribe, like I said, if you want to stay up to date on the latest transfer news surrounding Liverpool Football Club. I appreciate all of our channel members and our supporters here at Nothing But Reds. And until next time, Reds, take care.